वेलकम टू ए न्यू वीडियो ऑफ डॉन ऑफ जियो स्पेशल वर्ल्ड इन रिमोट सेंसिंग यू मे बी हेयर्ड अबाउट डिजिटल इमेज प्रोसेसिंग वॉट इज इट डिजिटल इमेज प्रोसेसिंग रिफर्स टू ए यूज ऑफ वेराइटी ऑफ टेक्निक्स एंड एल्गोरिजम्स टू मॉडिफाई इम्प्रूव एग्जामाइन एंड इंटरप्रिटेड डिजिटल इमेजेस ऑप्टेंड फ्रॉम रिमोट सेंसिंग प्लेटफॉर्म्स इन डिजिटल इमेज प्रोसेसिंग दे आर आर फोर टाइप्स ऑफ इमेज कलेक्शंस जियोमेट्रिक करेक्शन रेडियोमेट्रिक करेक्शन एटमोस्फेरिक करेक्शन टोपोग्राफिक करेक्शन दिस करेक्शंस आर मेनली एप्लाइड ऑन लेवल वन सैटेलाइट डेटा बट नावडेज सैटेलाइट डेटा आर एवेलेबल इन लेवल टू कलेक्शन इन प्रिवियस वी आर शोइंग द प्रोसेस ऑफ जियोमेट्रिक करेक्शन व्हिच इज ऑल्सो नोन एज जियो रेफरेंसिंग यू कैन चेक दोज भिडियोज फ्रम आवर चैनल टूडे आई एम शोइंग यू how we can manually apply radiometric correction on a level 1 satellite data in arcmap so let's start what is radiometric correction radiometric correction is a process that improves the quality and accuracy of remote sensing images by removing or reducing the effects of atmosphere sensor or illumination factors For this, you need a level one satellite data. I have downloaded two satellite datasets of Landsat with two different dates. I will show why I have downloaded two different dates data. After download, unzip those folders. For radiometric correction, we need an equation. For that, I go to USGS site. Here you can see two conversions. What is the difference between TOA radiance and TOA reflectance? The variable that is directly measured by remote sensing equipment is called radiance and its units are watt. Reflectance is a dimensionless quantity that is defined as a ratio of radiation that strikes a surface to radiation that is reflected of it. For radiometric correction, we will go for TOA reflectance the equation is TOA reflectance equals to reflectance multiplied by band x into digital number of that band plus reflectance at band x later we will divide this value by sine of sun elevation in radian now the question is where we can find this band details for that open the unzip satellite data folders here we will find a mtl text file open that file in this file you will get all metadata of the satellite data product like product id collection and level details sensor path and row cloud cover and many more here is the sun elevation data below that reflectance mult and reflectance add value of every bands are written these values are constant for every band for same satellite but the sun elevation will change for different dates
after getting all required values open an excel sheet and write down the values of any one dates data The sun elevation value is in degree, so convert it into radian with formula and get the sine value of it. Now open ArcMap and load those dates band 1 to band 7 data. These high and low values are digital number of this band. Search raster calculator and open it. You can do the correction one by one in raster calculator but we will do it in a batch right click on raster calculator and select batch add seven rows for seven bands double click on first row write down the values like the equation Save the output in a new folder with .tif extension. Right click on first row and click on fill. Change the band numbers and run. After few minutes of processing, all level 1 bands will be radiometrically corrected. Remove the added band and add all corrected bands. Now 
now you can see the high and low values are in decimal values with these bands now you can analyze your study area and make composites indices or other analysis if you want to learn about india through the maps and data then follow our instagram profile where i have uploaded different infographic maps of india